And also, I've I've heard many reports actually throughout the music industry that Sum 41 is currently working on a double album, which is going to be half punk, half metal. I was wondering, from what you are allowed to speak about, because obviously, you know, the album isn't out yet, uh, for what you actually are allowed to talk about and reveal, can you tell us a bit more about what us fans can actually expect from this up and coming Sum 41 project? Yeah, this was kind of a pandemic kind of record, too. It's, you know, I, I remember just kind of sitting home and it's been, I don't know, a year over the pandemic and i got a call from derek he's like uh i got i got a bunch of songs you know i have a, I have a bunch of ideas and i'm going to send them to you and start putting some bass ideas down on on them and we'll start talking about the record and he sent me a bunch of them and they were like drastically different from one another like you know i'm talking like a song sounded like something from all killer and then another song sounded like slayer <laughs> and i was like so <laughs> no, but there was a lot of them too like there was uh, I don't know. I think we ended up recording 18 or 20 songs in the end. Um, so when we had this whole, when we, we, we didn't have a plan, we just said, let's just record them all. And that's it. You know, we'll just, just record them. We have time. And by the end of it, we started chatting over text or email. And, um, the idea came, I was like, what about a double album? And we're like, yeah, do people, do people do that anymore? <laughs> like, is it, you know, like with the, the age of streaming, like, we we're like, we all got really excited about it. And the, the fact that one, there was a bunch of songs that were very like almost pop punk, old Sum 41 early days. And then the other a bunch of them that were really like metal, thrash metal, heavy. Um, so we're like, you know, let's maybe do that one side and one side like that. And we'll call it heaven and hell. And uh, that's the idea as, as of now. <laughs> I don't, and we don't have a release date. We don't even have a record label. Uh, so we're just in the... The late stages of kind of like finishing it up i think derek has some songs he's still got to sing we'll still have to mix it still have to master it and then we got to find someone to put it out and also i know a lot of the fans are probably wondering the same thing and i got to say obviously this album isn't done yet so if you want to skip this question i completely understand obviously the the, uh, the punk uh side of uh so i'm guessing the heaven side would be the punk side um if you can compare it to any one of your guys' last projects sound wise, like which one would you kind of like, you know, put it in the same category with? Kind of give the fans an idea of what of what they can really expect from the heaven side. Yeah, I think it's not so much like all killer as much. Um maybe like a cross between all killer and underclass hero. Um, you know, the the songs are you know, wouldn't be as long as like say a walk in disaster. Um but probably, you know, yeah, somewhere somewhere in that pop punk zone, underclass hero meets all killer. I gotta say, I'm definitely liking what I'm hearing. <laughs> I gotta say, I'm definitely enjoying what I hear there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But also as well, I do know that you guys actually just released some more tour tour dates as well. 